third time for Sui Rong Jin. Wow, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much. Fantastic. Well, parents, if your child is musically talented and you'd like to pick up a new skill in playing a new musical instrument, well, the place to look for is Music Lifestyle, located over at Clark Key. And uh, our friends from Music Lifestyle are yellow. They'd be more than happy to answer any questions you'd like to find out about enrolling your child with some music lessons, right? Okay, they're over there. Music Lifestyle, thank you very much. Okay, coming up, we have three very talented uh, two, two girls and a guy. It's going to sing us uh, two songs. And this is for the younger generation, like me. <laughs> uh, by the way, how many of you belong to the pioneer generation? Really? You look so young. Man, really? Pioneer generation? Wow, you look great. Congratulations. Well, well, well. Okay. And before we bring on the performer, we'd like to also remind you parents that for this EduSafe ceremony, you do not have to come on stage, or the child do not have to come on stage. You all have to be seated down as a family. Advisor, Mr. Chan Tun Sen, will come down to you, your child, and present the award to your child. So the family can take a group picture together. All right, this is very personal for a change, all right? So don't worry, you sit there with the child. The advisor will come to you, present the award to your child, and you can take a family picture with minister. Isn't that nice? Plus on top of that, we got buffet, prizes. Wow, wow, wow. And iPad to be worn, of course. All right, that's all happening later on. But right now, let's bring on our three very talented performers. Three of them, firstly named Danish, Sarah, and Esther. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome our performers. Let's give them a big round of applause. And they're going to sing you two songs. One from Tori Kelly, entitled Dear No One. And the other one from the very popular Taylor Swift, entitled Safe and Sound. Ladies and gentlemen, please say hello to Danish, Sarah and Aston. Over to you. I'm 
written the dreams and you will stick it up later on. So ladies and gentlemen, are you all ready to meet your child? To meet your stars? Uh, I want no response, uh, not ready. Uh. Are you all ready? Yes, if you're ready, ladies and gentlemen, the EMB 2014. Before that, I want to find out what 
the, the students are thinking. I've randomly selected three students on stage to answer some very simple questions. Not actually questions to tell us what they think or what they like to say to the parents. A random, huh? Mmm, let's see. 19-3, where's 19? Oh, hi, your name is Yu Xian. Hi Yu Xian, parents, where are your parents? Hi Yu Xian, parents, where are you? Oh, very nice. Okay, Yu Xian, would you like to say something to your, your parents? I'm very proud of my mother that she taught me a lot of things when I was young. And I'm also glad that um, she cares for me and she does me Oh, isn't that nice? Mommy, don't cry, don't cry. Mommy, don't cry. She's so happy. Congratulations, congratulations. Oh, you're not hearing. Congratulations. Okay, let's see who's next. Hmm, this is, this is a good number. 22 2. Chris, where's Chris? Hi, Chris. Oh, Chris is over there. Okay. Hi, Chris. Okay. So maybe you like to stand in front. Okay. Hi, Chris. Where, where are your parents? Oh, hi Chris, mommy, how do you do? Okay, maybe you'd like to say something to your mom. Okay, I want to thank my aunt and my mom for always being here for me and walking me through my troubled time. And I want to congratulate all the prize winners here. Oh, you must be very proud of them. And um, treat us better, lah, love us more. You can start by buying us more things. But but don't buy assessment books, okay? Uh, okay, uh, happy new year. <laughs> Wow, go buy assessment book, buy the iPad, iPad. Anyway, congratulations, Chris. Well done, very proud moment for you. Well done. Okay, one more. Uh, 19D, Ching Heng. Ching Heng? 19D? Oh, hi, hi, hi. Oh, hi, hi, Ching Heng. Are your parents here? Oh, there your mom. Hi, wow, looking very happy. Okay, Ji, would you like to say something to your mom? Uh, yes, I will thank her for everything that she gives me. Uh, Love me forever. Love you forever. She will keep loving you forever. You love your mother forever? Yeah. Yeah. Give them a big hand. Congratulations. Your mom is very proud. Thank you very much. And ladies and gentlemen, parents, once again, your stars. Let's give them a round of applause. Now, oh, this is the part that I, I like very much. Students, we want you to go down to your parents, give them the cupcakes, give them a hug and say, I love you, mommy and daddy. Thank you for everything. Stop buying me assessment books, buy me iPad. <laughs> anyway, let's give them all a big hand, ladies and gentlemen. Look down your parents, give them the cupcakes. They will give you the cards, give them a hug, and show them that you are much dearly appreciated. Thank you very much. Let's give them a round of applause. Thank you so much. Thank you. 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 Thank Hello, good afternoon to all the students, parents, friends and colleagues who are here with us today. So I hope all the students have given the little cupcake to your parents. Anyone has not done that yet? And I hope all the parents have given the little cards that you have signed for your children. Okay, now we will start the ceremony proper. Okay, first and foremost, where are all my students who are getting the awards today? Can you wave your hands? Okay, first of all, let me congratulate all of you. I'm quite sure that you all have worked very hard over the last one year to achieve what you have achieved for you to be here today. So congratulations, give yourself a big round of applause. But at the same time, okay, today's achievement is not all yours, which is why we invited your parents, your family to be here with you. Okay, as those of you who were here last year will remember, I share with all of you that when you have succeeded in life, always remember that the success is not just due to your hard work and your talent. Many of us are very talented, many of us are very hardworking. But in order for us to be successful, we must always remember our parents and the environment that have given us the opportunities that we have today. Last year, I shared with you all the story of myself. When I was in Cambridge University, there were many other people who were more talented than me, who were more hardworking than me from all over the world. But today, in life, they did not necessarily have the opportunities that I have for my talents to flourish. So it's the same for you, that similarly, that no matter how hard you have worked, no matter how talented you may be, 
There is still one other ingredient, which is your family and the community that has support that have supported you. Which is why on your table today, we also honour your parents and families who are here with you on each and every table. We also have a community leader who have volunteered their time and effort to come here and join you in your celebration. That at the same time, when you have succeeded, that you too will remember your families, that they are the reason for your success, then at the same time, I hope you will also remember the community which you are part of. That maybe one of these days, you will be the person hosting the table and sharing your stories with the next generation of Singaporeans. Next year, in a few days' time, we will celebrate Singapore's 50th anniversary. 50 years ago, very few of us would have thought that Singapore would be where we are today. Very few of us would be able to imagine what Singapore will be in 50 years' time. Maybe by then, we no longer drive cars. Maybe by then, we have automated vehicles that bring us from point A to point B. Maybe by then, Singapore, the landscape would have changed. But whatever it is, you who are here today, the students you are here today, I'm very sure that you will be the architects of the future Singapore. You will live the dreams that you want to be and you'll be the stars that you can be. But in order for you to do that, always remember that regardless of your station in life in future, when you have succeeded, always remember to give that bit back to the community that have so supported you in your entire journey. Otherwise, your journey will be empty and meaningless. Otherwise, even with all the riches in the world, without the, your family, without the community, it is but nothing in your heart. So with that, I wish you all the very best and never, never let any obstacles bring you down. Because for the last 50 years, if we can achieve what we have achieved as a country with so little, there is nothing that can uh, stop us from achieving even more with all that we have today. If you have read The Straits Times today, there was an article by Rachel Chung. She was rather pessimistic about Singapore, but I don't agree with her. Because if 50 years ago we can achieve so much with so little, there is nothing to say that your generation cannot achieve even more for yourself and for Singapore. Today, the schools and the facilities you have, we can only imagine 50 years ago. So seize those opportunities that you have in your schools, for some of those of you who are in the ITE, other people come to our ITE and think that they are universities. Because even their universities are never as good as our ITEs or polytechnics. So you have all the opportunities in the world, so seize it. At your time, at your age, I suppose all of you who are receiving the award today would have been out of Singapore on an airplane before. Am I correct? Am I correct? At your age, at my time, the furthest I had been was to Johor Bahru. The first time I took a plane was when I was 18 years old, on a trip to Brunei jungle to train. So you have and you will see much more of the world than me. At your age, all of you know what is the internet. With a few clicks of the buttons, you will know what is happening in the entire world. At my time, we only, if we are fortunate, have the Encyclopedia Britannica. I don't know whether you still know what is an encyclopedia. Probably today you know what's Google, but you won't know what's an encyclopedia. During your, my time in Cambridge University, to send a letter home, it takes two weeks. Every year, we only spend a princely sum of £30 to buy a short phone card to make a two-minute phone call home. Today you can Skype every moment that you like. So cherish all these opportunities, but never, never forget to give back something to your family and to the community when you have succeeded. So thank you very much for all of you for being here today. Continue to work hard, not just for your own success, but for the success of this country, so that we together will live our dreams and celebrate SG50, SG100 in your lifetime. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Mr. Chan Chun Singh. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, the, the, the boys and girls ready to the recipients. And of course, the parents can take a group picture with Minister and of course, your child receiving the award this year at the Bona Vista Educative Award Ceremony 2014.
And for those of you wondering uh, how do we get uh, you get a hold of the pictures taken by the photographers, very simple. Nowadays everything is uh, normal picture, everything is social media, you know you have your internet, your email, or Facebook. Just go to the Facebook account of one of the right? We'll, we'll upload the pictures. All the pictures from the sixth session of EduSafe Award Ceremony. Sixth session and we'll upload it on Facebook. As long as you like the page, you can view the pictures. So pick up your phone, go to the Facebook page and go to My Bona Vista. Like the page and everything will be settled. You can view the pictures one week from today. Alright? So just pick up the phone and do it right now. And as I was saying earlier on, ladies and gentlemen, we have the parent and child look alike contest. In a few minutes, we'll open the competition to the parents and the child. If you think that your child looks like you, take a snapshot and put your picture up on the board right at the back where Grace is. There she is, right? If we have a point up to the last table, you can proceed to the buffet table now. From table 1 to 12, wait a minute, yeah? Hold on, hold on. So are you I saw you very hungry, yeah? Wait, nah, hold on. You're table 1, right? From 1 to 12, you wait for a little while. But from 13 to the last table, please proceed to the buffet table and enjoy your little snack we've created and we prepared for all of you. Alright? So please enjoy your meal and uh, of course, uh, in a few moments, we'll open up the competition for the parent and child look-alike. We've got top three prizes to be given away. Whilst you're presenting the awards to the children, okay, in a few moments, we'll have some entertainment on stage for your listening pleasure and, of course, to keep entertained throughout the afternoon. And don't forget, we've got prizes to be won, so please, if you receive the award, the child, the parents, we'd like to invite you to stay back with us to the end of the award ceremony. Thank you very much. Alright, the buffet table is uh, ready, so table 13 onwards to the last table. You can proceed to the buffet table for your light refreshments. Okay, whilst you're having your buffet and receiving the awards from table 1 to 12, we'd like to bring you some entertainment on stage. First
they have an amazing journey in the NTU Harmonica Band. Thank you very much. Let's give them a round of applause. Thank you. Thank you. Let's see it. Thank you. Okay, from uh, Harmonica, we move on to some hip hop. Wow, hip hop. Hip hop dance. I was uh, reclaiming the stage. We'd like to once again yeah, to inform you, ladies and gentlemen, that the parent and child look alike contest is now open. So, you would like to take part? The photo booth is right at the back. So, you want to take part? Yeah, you, you, you look alike. Yeah, yeah. Go and take a picture right at the back. We got a Polaroid camera for you. And you might stand to win surprises. Come. Right, it's over at the back. Okay, wait till you finish, right? No problem. We got top three prizes for the most look alike father and son or mother and daughter. Oh. Father and daughter, mother and son. Why not? Alright. Once you can be, once you receive the cert, you can proceed to the photo booth section. Okay. Let's see whether our next performer is ready for some hip hop dance. Ready? Ready? Okay. Just give us a minute. Okay, I think they're all set for some dance for second performance, ladies and gentlemen. It's the last performance by Yadam. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Yadam with an electrifying freestyle dance. Hip oh, hip hop. Can I, can I dance like this? Let's see. This, this. Oh. Hip hop. Hmm. I don't think I can. I'll try. Thank you. 
when we play flip the spoon. This year we're gonna make them work a little harder. Okay, firstly, uh, boys and girls, your job is quite difficult. All you have to do is, is call the noodle, whatever noodle it is. <laughs> Brother Steve, are we gonna show the video? Okay, we will show the video, you watch. Part one will be done by the, ch the child. Part two by the parent. Can you see? Okay, we have part one. Noodling around. This is the, the, the student part. Noodling around. No hands allowed. And then when you finish, you put up the hands and then come to the parents. It's called Johnny Apple Step. Johnny Apple Step, the widest part of the Red Phillips Apple is at the top and has five distinct blocks at the bottom. We know two that is not so easy, but you can try. In this challenge, the contestant will stack five of them, one on top of the other, holding a quick stand at the time. If the tower falls, it can be restacked. And parents, when you finish, you have to take the bell, okay? Alright, we're going to start out with the, the students. Spaghetti noodle, noodle. Alright, your job is to... Uh, brother Steve, I try, huh? Hey, oh, I need spectacles, I can't see.
Wait, focus, focus. Wait, wait. I'm just standing for five seconds. Cannot fail, must pass. You see, you, you, you got him so excited. Oh. Yes, brother? Okay, do we have iPad? Where's the iPad? Is this the iPad? Brother Steve, is it the iPad? Oh. For this team, congratulations. This is iPad to be worn. It's not the Apple iPad, it's iPad on. No, iPad to be worn. So, iPad to be worn. Say more. I never brought you a really iPad to be worn. Correct. iPad to be worn. Yeah. But let's see, you see that? Wait, wait, wait. Wait, I must show you iPad, I'm not lying. Let me open up the bag and see iPad. This is good. Open it up, put it on the eye. It re relieves your tension after a hard day's work. Really? iPad to be worn. So you wear your iPad at night, so iPad to be worn. Congratulations. Yes. Sorry sister, I only got one iPad lah. Huh? I think you don't want this iPad, right? So we got prizes for you too. Also, uh, uh, a little goodies for you. Don't worry boy. Your dream is to achieve it the next time. Nothing venture, nothing gay. Let's give them a big hand. Prizes for them too, one more. No one walk away empty handed. Let's give them a big hand. At least they try, right? Thank you very much. Thank you. Please enjoy your iPad. <laughs> I never, really? This is a good iPad. Because in a box, there are five iPads. You can use for five days. Really, it's a lavender. It relaxes you after a hard day's work. You study too hard. Use that after every night. Wow, very good. Well rejuvenated. Congratulations. Please give yourselves a big hand. Thank you. That game is not easy. Oh, really, really. Thank you, thank you very much. Please do not go away yet because at the end of the ceremony, we've got something very special for everyone. No more iPad, but it is time to get your feet and move to all of to the beat, all right? But before we do that, let's wait for our advisor to finish presenting all the awards. Coming up is something very special for each and every one of you. in the uh, parent and child look-alike contest. Results will be out on the 18th of January. We'll pick the top three to win prizes and we notify you by SMS. And for your info, ladies and gentlemen, there are six sessions of the first three awards. There are six sessions we got today, later on, on the third, on the fourth. So total, we've got six sessions. And um, every session we have contestants taking part in this look-alike contest, but don't worry, the top three will win prizes and be notified by an SMS. Oh, that game uh, really gives me a good workout. So, not so easy, right boy? But never mind, you will try and you'll succeed the next time. So well done, well done, good try. taken the, the today's Educative Award. All you have to do is to go down, go to Facebook page and like our Facebook page, which is My Bona Vista. Like the page and you can view all the pictures and course, including those pictures for the parent and child look alike. All right, the photographs will be all uploaded in one week's time. So in one week, you get to see all the photographs taken from the ceremony right here at Bona Vista. So just go to My Bona Vista on the Facebook page, like the page, 
and then you get to view the pictures from one week from today. Just one more performance to go before we um, come to the finale part of the program. We got a Ray, Ray dance crew from the Ray dance crew, hip hop dance performers. Are they ready? So ladies and gentlemen, the Rebels dance crew with a hip hop dance performance. Let's welcome them on stage. Stars. So students, 
if you're given the star sticker, all you require to do is to write down your dreams and paste it on the three panels where the center will reach out for the stars. Tell us our dreams, your dreams, so your parents can come forward and view the, uh, the boards. I was saying that there's one who says I like to be a, a good keeper. Yeah, that's very nice. My dream is I wish all my family members very well. Wow, that's very nice. And there's one here is um, I like my dream is to become a chef in the future. Wow, chef, master chef junior. Very nice. And we have. A successful person. Very good, very good. Okay, we have, we have so many more stickers yet to be pasted on. So if your child has pasted on the sticker, maybe parents can like to just come and have a look at it. Oh, that's your son. It's okay. Loving the animals is not easy. It's, it, it's, it's a great job. You know, it needs a lot of passion, a lot of understanding about it. Xavier, is that you? Um, what's your favorite animal? A bird? Oh, your bird. Wow, very nice. Okay. <laughs> very good, very good. Okay, uh, the boys and girls, you've written your dream and we'd like you to come forward and just paste your sticker on this board. And along the, across the room, we have some posters about some motivational quotes, a reach out for the stars, don't give up, uh, dig in a little deeper, yes, whatever you dream of, you can, you can achieve it as long as you put your heart and soul in it. In a few moments, we'll be, we'll be uh, having the finale part of the program. I'm just uh, waiting for the advisor to complete the award presentation. What else? What else is up here? I want to be a world-class footballer. Wow! Would be a doctor, a part-time gamer. Oh, part-time gamer. Oh my God! Cool, yeah, cool. I want to be a lawyer. Wow! What's this? This 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 boy or this 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 girl. I want to dream. The dream is Jenny says I want to dream to be what I want to wish to be. <laughs> wow, that's nice. Okay, uh, you can have your the, your phone and come and see some pictures. What's this? I want to be a cartoonist. Wow, that's, that's not easy, yeah. But don't worry, I want to be. I want to study in UK. At three, at three. This one is cool. My dream is to be the most successful guy cop. Ah, please, please. Wow, Gerald, where's Gerald? Mm, successful police man, huh? Okay, just one more table. Very nice, so the board is open up for you, so please, if you have your sticker, please write it down, write your dreams, and tell your parents, tell everyone what's your dream. And we, we wish you all the very, very best, and may your dreams come true. Just one more table for the award presentation, the last one. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. We'll come to the end of uh, presenting all the awards to the recipients. To all the students, my heartiest congratulations. You deserve a nice round of applause. Come on, give yourselves a big hand. Well done. Keep up the good work. Well done, well done, well done. Okay, as promised, the finale part of the uh, program is that the team for today's FDCA award is all about the dreams. And those of you who came last year, you remember we had a song, it's You Raise Me Up. And this year we chose a song that is a very appropriate for the theme of this year's award, is The Power of Dreams. So in a few moments, we would like to invite all of you to please stand and sing along with the song. If you don't know the words, it's okay, we have the lyrics on the screen. Celine Dion is a powerful woman, a powerful singer, 
and she was a woman with all the dreams to be successful and she's indeed a successful singer and in a few moments we'll invite all of you to be stand, can you all please stand and for the finale if you can see the screen, sing along to the song, we know the words, if you do not know, just wave together with your child, hold his hands, hold her hands and together in one team, one family and one community, we can fulfill our dreams. Whichever dreams you dream of, it will come true one day.
dalam Zumba, Zumba. You know what Zumba? Zumba for the kids is called Zumba Tomic. Zumba for the adults is called Zumba Fitness. Zumba for the elderly, the pioneer generation is called Zumba Go. So Zumba is for everybody. Don't go away. Close the door. Lock the door. Let's do some Zumba before we go. Are you ready to Zumba? One, two, three. Let's Zumba with Jesslyn, the People's Association trainer. Oh, with the young ones, huh? Ah, okay. Are you ready, ladies and gentlemen? The young, the working class, and the pioneer generation. We got plenty of space. It's time to move the body to keep you young, healthy, and happy. Because when you're happy, your dreams will come true. If you've never done Zumba, your dream is to do Zumba. Right now. Ah, ready? Are you ready? Yeah. You're ready, let's hit the beat and let's do some Zumba.
we cannot really go home and try some Zumba. Zumba is a great fitness. Once again, thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. Give yourselves once again another round of applause to Jesse and of course the kids. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And on that note, ladies and gentlemen, we come to